Hi there, so in this video I'm going to be solving an example on vectors. So here's the example, it says we have a vector u, the points from the point 1, 3 and 0, the point 3, 5 and negative 1. And the example is asking us to find the magnitude of the vector u and then to find the unit vector, the points in the same direction. Now before I start solving this question, um, just want to remind you that uh, we represent points in a different way than when we represent vectors. So if I want to represent a point, I use these brackets. Um, if I want to represent a vector, I use these sharper brackets. Okay, so let's get back to the question. Uh, first thing, we want to find the magnitude of vector u. So first we need to find vector u. And in order to find the vector, we just have m point minus star point. So vector u would be 3 minus 1, 5 minus 3, and negative 1 minus 0. So vector u becomes 2, 2, and negative 1. So now we have vector u. Now if I want to find the magnitude of vector u, just use the formula from the last video. Square root of each component squared, so 2 squared plus 2 squared plus negative 1 squared, which is the square root of 4 plus 4 plus 1, square root of 9, which is equal to 3. So now I, we're done with the first part the magnitude of the vector u is equal to 3. Uh, we could have solved this in a different way. We could have just found the distance between these two points. So if you actually um, try and find the distance between these two points, it will be 3 as well, which is another way of solving for part A. Now, part B is asking us to find the unit vector, the points in the same direction. So, we have the formula for to find the unit vector. So to find the unit vector, we have the vector itself and then divide it by its magnitude. So we have the vector and we have its magnitude. So u hat will be vector u, which we found to be 2, 2 and negative 1 divided by its magnitude, which we found to be 3. Therefore, u hat is equal to 2 over 3, 2 over 3, and negative 1 over 3. And that's the answer to part B. Um, if you have any questions, please leave them down in the comments section below, um, and I'll be more than happy to answer them. Good luck.